For nearly eight years, Angelina Jolie and Brad Pitt have been embroiled in a bitter dispute, not just over their French winery, but also over the upbringing of their six children Maddox, Pax, Zahara, Shiloh, and twins Knox and Vivienne. Their tumultuous relationship has seen allegations of physical abuse, custody battles, and even name changes among their children, leaving the Jolie Pitt family in a constant state of tension. Academy Award-winning actor John Voigt, Jolie's father, recently shared his thoughts on the family feud during an interview with Fox News Digital. Although Voigt expressed regret over not being able to communicate with his grandchildren as much as he would like, he was clear on one point the need for resolution. I wish they'd find a way to make peace, Voigt said, noting that the children deserve stability. He emphasized his love for his daughter and grandchildren and urged Pitt to take responsibility and end the ongoing conflict. Jolie and Pitt were married for two years before their marriage unraveled in 2016 following an alleged physical altercation on a plane. This incident marked the end of their 12-year relationship, and they were legally declared single in 2019. In 2022, Jolie was granted sole physical custody of the minor children, including Shiloh at that time, after a brief period where Pitt had joint custody. Although Pitt was allowed custodial time with the children, the current status of their custody arrangement remains unclear. In a June 2020 interview with Vogue India, Jolie explained her decision to leave Pitt, stating it was for the well-being of her family. She emphasized that her focus remains on her children's healing, despite the challenges they face from media scrutiny. Jolie described her children as six very brave, very strong young people who are learning to navigate their own truths amidst the lies spread about them. The couple's French winery, Chateau Miraval, has become a focal point in their ongoing legal battles. In 2022, Pitt sued Jolie for breach of contract after she attempted to sell her company, Nouval, to Tenute Del Mondo, a subsidiary of the Stoli Group, thereby transferring her 50% ownership in Miraval. Jolie's attorneys argued that she and her children were victims of Pitt's alleged abuse and cover-up, stating that Jolie had not acted out of malice when selling her share of Miraval. Instead, they claimed Pitt refused to buy her interest unless she agreed to a newly expanded NDA, which included an $8.5 million holdback to enforce her silence about his alleged abuse. A source close to Jolie commented on the situation, condemning Pitt's insistence on an NDA to cover up his conduct. The source emphasized that Jolie never pressed charges against Pitt and left him with their properties, only to be sued by him and attacked in the press. According to the source, all Jolie wants is peace and the chance to heal her family. In contrast, a source close to Pitt dismissed these claims, asserting that the legal dispute was purely a business matter and accusing Jolie of making it personal to distract from the fact that she had initially requested an NDA about their divorce. The source also criticized Jolie for breaching their agreement and selling her share of Miraval, thereby depriving their children of their inheritance. As the legal battle over Miraval continues, Pitt has faced another personal blow. In May, their daughter Shiloh filed to remove Pitt from her hyphenated last name, Jolie Pitt, a move that reportedly stemmed from the alleged abuse. Shiloh, who turned 18 that month, hired her own attorney to handle the name change. Additionally, Pitt's other daughters, Vivienne and Zahara, have also dropped Pitt from their last names in professional and personal settings. For instance, Vivienne was listed as Vivienne Jolie in a playbill for The Outsiders, a project she worked on with her mother, while Zahara identified herself as Zahara Marley Jolie in a video during her time at Spelman College. The news of Shiloh's legal action deeply upset Pitt, who reportedly felt great sadness over losing his connection with his children. Despite the ongoing conflict, Pitt is said to be happy in his relationship with Eines de Ramon, though the separation from his children continues to cause him significant pain. Jolie, meanwhile, has spoken openly about the toll the past few years have taken on her. In an interview with Harper's Bazaar, she revealed that the last decade, particularly the last four years, had left her with both visible and invisible scars. She described the difficulty of dealing with emotional pain, especially when it involves seeing loved ones suffer and being unable to live as freely as one desires. However, Jolie expressed a sense of resilience, feeling that life was returning to her despite the challenges.